the landscape is uh, changing in terms of who's making the first move and everything. Mm. Well, you're you you specifically you're in a unique position because you have a a girlfriend who is very upfront and straightforward. And I think as women get older, they're becoming more upfront and straightforward. You know, obviously we're both getting older, so the women we're dealing or I'm, I'm single, so the women women I'm dealing with are are maturing in that sense. But even then, I think there's always still gonna be some responsibility on the guy um i think it is changing like women are are making themselves more available because before Mm -hmm. it was just kind of like you know you're a damsel in distress blah 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 hopefully giga chat or whoever comes in and sweeps you off your feet and and seduces you or whatever but i think now it's like women aren't afraid to flirt more they're not afraid to ask the questions more they're not afraid to you know show themselves off a little bit more but i don't know i just feel like there's still responsibility for the guy to make that move or to initiate a day or or whatever what do you think i agree i think i think there always will be that responsibility for the guy i think that's just like human nature you mm-hmm. know the provider like the the, the uh, you know everything that historically with the guy role in the relationship i think that will always play a part But I do feel like there's a little bit of a change more recently just because of all these dating apps. Mm. I feel like that's kind of shifted a little bit. Um, If you go talk to somebody who's older than us and they never came up with dating apps, I feel like there was a lot more pressure on the guy to always make the first move because you were were meeting people, let's say, organically, like out and about at the bar, you know, through friend groups, whatever. You were always like meeting somebody in person. And I feel like at that time like it was very important for the guy to have a good first move um be respectful and and take their shot but now with all these apps i feel like especially bumble i mean bumble i know is an app where i think the girls have to message first oh you're right yeah i think that is yeah so like they have to make the first move on on that app because if two people match and she doesn't message him first well then nothing's gonna start there's no conversation that's gonna start so I feel like with the dating apps, um, women have now, they have more freedom to start the conversation at least. And then if the conversation is started by them, I think then the guy can kind of still take over and still play the typical historical role of the guy making the first move. Like, you know, being the one who steps up and says, hey, let's go on a date or let's meet in person and, and continue this so I think that's changed it a little bit. Mm. Yeah, I think you might be right. I think women are making it easier, especially if they like the guy. Because before it was, you know, as a guy, you typical movie scene, you start sweating, palm sweaty. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And you just got to walk up to this girl who gave you no signals at all and just shoot your shot right. and see what happens. Whereas now, if a woman likes yeah. you, she'll give you some signals, maybe some eye contact, yeah. Some yeah. whatever. Um, and then from there, you just kind of have some, I don't know, guys can be oblivious sometimes, but you got to just have enough common sense to realize the signs and, and, <laughs> and don't miss an opportunity. But uh, yeah, that's funny. That's funny.